When students leave for break, many will miss Wisconsin's presidential primary election Tuesday. However, County Clerk Karen Peters doesn't expect student voter turnout to decrease. I think they'll still have the same amount of turnout, it's just that they'll be voting by absentee instead. Peters admits that few absentee ballots have been collected so far. Political science professor Donald Downs is not surprised. Students tend to be less aggressive in terms of getting absentee ballots than, than other voters. So um, I think it'll keep the student output down, absolutely. College Republicans chairman Jeff Snow says spring break and a weak Republican field has contributed to this sense of apathy. I mean, we're fighting against a uh, spring break that people are excited about and a lackluster primary that's not exciting. I mean, there's no Barack Obama of the Republicans like the way that he excited college students. There's, there's not that enthusiasm for, let's say, Mitt Romney. For some students, though, they are simply unfamiliar with the voting process. I don't really know what an absentee ballot is. Sophomore Claire McCabe says more students would vote if they were better informed about the candidates and how to vote. There's not really that much like information going around about it. It's just kind of like you do your own research. While it's too late to request an absentee ballot by mail, students can still vote right here in the City County Building this Friday from 8.15 a.m. till 6.30 p.m. For the Badger Report, I'm Noah Getzel.